A very Linux problem is screenshots, okay? There's no real good default way to do this if you're not using a desktop environment like uh, GNOME or KDE or Unity or something like that. I don't know which ones exist anymore. Um, but if you are a Chad like me and you are using i3WM, there is no good way by default to take screenshots. You have to write your own tool. For a thousand years, I used a horrendous bash script wrapped around Scrot. Scrot is a command line tool that basically, if I run that, that just captures my entire screen and saves it in my home directory. Um, yeah. If I run scrot-s, I can take a selection. You see that? That is sort of normal and what people expect when you take a screenshot, you take a selection. I didn't, it aborted it, whatever. Um, now, look what happens. I'll t turn on screen key just to prove it to you. If I press print screen, whoa, look at this. Has it frozen? I don't know, but I can take a whole selection like this. And now I've got all the edit tools. Uh, I hope this is recording. Sort of frozen my screen. I can do all sorts. I can draw arrows. I can draw. Um, where's just the freehand text? Wow, a thumbnail. And now I can save that, or I can copy it. So I've just copied it, and I can save it as well with Control S. I don't know if that actually recorded something, but that software. We're going to pretend it recorded something. And if not, I'll put something in and post. No, I won't. Who cares? It acted like Windows Sniffing Tool. Now that software is called Flameshot. Holy buckets, it is amazing. I recommend you install Flameshot and set up in your i3 config to bind print screen, it's called print, to exact this. It is incredible, it is amazing. Just wanted to shout it out. Oh, there we go. Flameshot GUI is that's what you want in your i3 config changed my whole world. I can now screenshot like a Windows user and people are like, look at these annotated screenshots. Amazing. It is amazing. Sometimes something just like blows your mind in a really simple and stupid way. And mine was finally getting really simple screenshots to work. Like the bash script I had was insane. It used D menu to do scrot. So you would do scrot dash S. It was like you'd run print screen in D menu or hotkey and it would do um, like all sorts of weird renaming and horrible jank. Let's see if I can find it. Do I have a scripts folder? Yes. Screenshot. Oh my goodness. Okay. <laughs> Here it is. So it, this is what it used to do. Let's uh, take away the comments here. Um, so it list my current PNGs. Oh. Oh my gosh, this is horrible. Did this just run? What? This is like an, a demon. The fuck? <laughs> okay, so what it would do is it would find the latest PNG entered into my home directory, which is where Scrot saves them by default. <laughs> Save that to variable. Sup fam, what do you want to call the screenshot? And then delete the spaces from what I enter. Okay. Then it would save it into screenshots with the name. And it would send me a notification saying that, oh, it's moved. Then it would, X clip selection, clipboard, dash G. Oh, copy it to my clipboard, nice. And then it would notify, say, this is horrible. This line here makes me go, Bleh! So this would just run. While true, oh, ENTR. This is the ticker. This is like a... I notify thing which would watch for changes. Still, this is incredibly inefficient and shit. Anyway, this is what I used to use. I'm pretty embarrassed about this. I must have written this a hundred years ago when I was a young warthog. Bye!